This is one of CPI's new seismic two-post rack addition to the seismic family. It's, uh, as you can see, it's a fully uh, steel construction. It's rated for 1,000 pounds uh, against the NEBS ZR, uh, GR63 rating for Zone 4. And what Zone 4 means is there are certain parts of the country, the United States, that's divided up to susceptibility or probability of earthquakes occurring. Zone 4 tends to be on the west coast but even in the middle of the country and on the east coast there's a probability of earthquakes occurring in the next 50 years. So we've uh, tested it to the highest standard which is the NEBS uh, GR63 uh, Zone 4 and we've, we've tested it at 1,000 pound rating which is best in class, best in breed, best in competition for a two post rack. We also have a number of other uh, unique features that we've developed into the rack. Uh, one of the things is the cable management. You can see on this side there's some uh, uh, rectangular holes that you can plug in seven RMU uh, cable fingers so it makes a nice convenient low-cost way for data centers or telecom uh, installations to provide some sort of cable management or power management on your on your cords. Uh, we also have a, a VCS, a v vertical cable manager system that we especially developed for the seismic two post rack and what this will allow you to do is it's actually a telescoping unit so it's two single-sided that are back-to-back, -back, making a double-sided cable manager, uh, providing uh, the, the flexibility, the adjustability, so that you can adjust it out to the appropriate spot to uh, collect all of your various wires. On the insides of this, we've uh, actually put some additional hooks in here that allow you to uh, mount your vertical power strips on the back side of these cable managers in the opening here. So it makes a n nice convenient way of uh, providing power uh, vertically to your rack. The rack itself is available in two different sizes. It's available in a 24 inch footprint or a 28 inch footprint. The 24 inch footprint is good for the 19 inch EIA rails which are available in 12 24 tapped holes or square punched holes and the 28-inch uh, uh, wide footprint is uh, good for the 23-inch rails. Both versions are available only in a 7-foot high. 7 feet will yield uh, 44 RMUs. It's actually 44 and a half, but there's not too many people that are going to use that half RMU, but it's important to note because of the structural integrity of this unit and the 1,000-pound rating, we did have to put some appropriate braces on the top, so we're down to 44 RMUs. But, uh, that's full RMUs of rack equipment. The uh, rails themselves can be adjustable. They're shipped six inches apart that from the depth, but they can be adjusted into a three inch depth. So if you've got those shelves or equipment that attaches to a standard two post three inch depth rack, no problem with the CPI seismic rack, you're gonna be able to adjust those rails. Uh, you could actually adjust them offset so you could have a four and a half inch rating if you wanted to have it flush on the front or flush on the back for whatever reason, but most of the time in the seismic environment you're going to use it at a six inch uh, uh, depth interval. A couple other features we have here, it's, uh, as I mentioned early on, it's, it's fully uh, welded construction so it's fully bonded and grounded. In addition to that, uh, you'll see on the back side there's two studs on the bottom of the rack and two studs on the top of the rack. These studs are provided in each and every unit and we also include a to a terminal ground block along with a little tube of antioxidant so that you can attach that to the unit and make sure that you've got a, a good electrical uh, uh, connection uh, to the uh, seismic rack. Cable managers can be just uh, attached on the side similar to any of our two or four post racks. Uh, the standard uh, evolution cable managers and MCS double sided cable managers will attach uh, and work just fine on this rack. Some of the smaller ones like the VCS uh, will not, so that's why we come up with this uh, unique one. Um, also we've included uh, a couple of uh, nice little features on the side of the rack where you can mount vertical power strips on that as well. So you could have it actually vertical power strip on the outside of the rack or the way we've designed the rack on the inside here you could actually take your vertical power strip and attach it right in this little channel in the front or in the back on the left or the right hand side of the unit. So it, a really convenient way of, uh, of getting power vertically to all of your, uh, your rack components. There's a couple of options that we've also uh, created for this. Uh, there's a, uh, a terminal block, an outlet block that's available. Uh, we've actually provided the drilled holes on the bottom of the unit in the front and the back. 
and it would just be a, an electrical outlet box that you could just go ahead and screw directly to the rack, which is sometimes convenient for the old, older telecom uh, installations. As far as uh, installation, we've, we've even uh, gone so far as to develop a, a special uh, product, which is an installation template, nothing more than a uh, piece of uh, aluminum, but it's going to be very valuable for those installations where you have multiple rack install, uh, units installed so that uh, the contractor can simply uh, lay this uh, template out on the floor and drill the appropriate four holes. The template, uh, again, you could just go ahead and you drill your holes. It will allow you to move it along and pre-drill these holes without having to, to pick up this very heavy rack, which weighs about 185 pounds. So you can go ahead and set up your installation, drill your holes, set your rack down, and you're good to go. CPI also provides, along with each and every rack, uh, a number of four different, uh, I think they're like quarter-inch steel washers that will be uh, used on the, uh, on the feet uh, to securely attach it to the floor. We have a waterfall that's also available. It's a nice little option. Uh, you see that uh, it's got an uh, adjustable radius. You can uh, telescope this out left or right. It's got a radius drop and a nice big uh, cable trough tray on the top for wires that need to go, cables that need to go from uh, the left to the right side. Questions that you might have or additional product uh, requests, please visit uh, chatsworth.com. You'll find not only the seismic rack there, but all of our rack and cabinet products and all the various accessories you might need to fill out your data center or your telecom room.